What's going on guys, Merrick here, back with another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Let's Play. Last episode we made it through Mount, uh, Mount, fuck. We made it through Rock Tunnel, and we had to skip a few trainers to go ahead and get out of there, because unfortunately we can't get through it and battle all the trainers in such a timely manner. So we went back, we're gonna go ahead and take on these last few trainers in here before we make our way over to Lavender Town. We had a pretty close call earlier against an Ace Trainer, and we definitely don't need that again. So we need to do a lot more uh, Pokemon catching so that our Pokemon can level up further because really with the way that one, that battle was going, we could have got clocked. About to send in another Machop. Calm the, down there, Triple Mohawk. Jeez. Alright. I think we're, we're just gonna let Pro Strats handle these last... Uh, I think there's two more trainers in here. Uh, just so that we don't have any more trouble with it. Plenty of Pokeballs, you run low, come talk to me. Okay. I, you know, I feel like someone else has said that before, too. Why does it look like you can get over there? Oh, never mind. Never mind, I know where that is. I'm dumb. Huh. Well, this is gonna be a uh, interesting matchup. I feel like I want to switch out to Nidorino <clears throat> and see if he can handle this. Cause I don't know how much damage Vine Whip's gonna do. been resisted even against the fucking Ivysaur. What's the point in that shit? We're not gonna outspeed. And then we outspeed. <laughs> Went for Poison Sting. What is this dumb bitch's deal? Yeah, Gary, get in there! I'm just gonna go for Dig again, because I'm not sure if a Headbutt would finish it off with the level difference. I'm in the middle of trying to look up right now and see 
when the last good move he learns. He learns Drill Run at 24, Rock Slide 43, Earthquake 48. Damn. And he doesn't evolve into a Rhydon until 42 anyways. Let's have a mirror match. Except mine's prettier. So let's see... Nidorino... Yeah, he hasn't learned Poison Jab until 39. I'm gonna have to look up and actually go through his moveset and see what... See what he can learn, because TM-wise, we may not need to wait for Poison Jab. We might be able to just get better moves. Alright, time to finish this! Oh, I get it. There was a, a picnicker with Nidorina and a camper with Nidorino. I got it. I get it. Ha ha, that's clever. Alright. Let's get out of here. Ba 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 -ba 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 -ba. Are you serious? More trainers. All right, let's put Inazuma out front. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. Well, that was just dumb. Okay, that was really dumb. Ha! <laughs> Please. Inazuma eats Thunderbolts like that for breakfast. Speaking of which, I've missed breakfast today. <laughs> That's an in Pidgeotto? Alright. I mean, we could have mirror matched with Pidgeotto, but... Actually, I should have. If it lives this Thunderbolt. Oh, that's why we didn't, because Horus is, is stupid weak. We're doing like, hey! I see your Pokemon, I raise it one shiny. I see your Pokemon, I raise it one shiny. Our team is, is battered. We, we really need to get to the Pokemon Center. Let's battle this last kid real quick. Abby, I'm good with that. We're not 
not playing with no leech seeds, none of that. We're just going straight for. Are you fucking kidding me? How did you live? How did you take so less, so much less damage that second hit? That's retarded. pretty shitty. Friggin' Sand Shrew has like an awesome sand attack animation. Sand Slash? Just bad. Okay, no! Come on, Pro Strats! Alright, now's our chance. Got each other's backs. Alright, let's get down here, heal. We'll come back and we'll battle these two goons here. Uh, okay. Hey, it's a keybone. Running up to Lavender Tower. Alright. And there's our rival! There's Jesse! Alright, uh, so we're not gonna follow him because we have other shit to do. What was the move we were waiting for Pikachu to learn before we evolved him? Wasn't it Thunder? No, you stupid shit. Yeah, in level 30 he learns Thunder. But if he evolves at if he if he learns Thunder Punch when he evolves, then let's go. Then I don't need Thunder. Because Thunder Punch has the paralysis. 100 accuracy, 75 base power is pretty good. Um, and then he can have Headbutt and Brick Break. Let's go ahead and see if we can get that Thunderstone.
gotta battle this bitch because fucking A, she's gotta stand in our way. Fucking Aubrey. Oh, and she's got a fucking Clefairy. You're gonna get in my way with a Clefairy. I ain't got time for this. Pro Strats! Well, that didn't do a lot. How dare you kiss my fucking Ivysaur! Try to use a one hit KO move. Holy shit! Are you serious right now? Alright, Mist again. Show this fucking fairy fuck what you're all about. That wasn't very nice of it, was it, Mistigan? Show him that payback's a bitch. Stop! Tell me something to make a fairy! Well, you shouldn't have gotten my way. You should have let me on. Let me pass. Let me go about my life. Alright, so we've returned. With our Thunderstone, let's go ahead and evolve our Pikachu. It is time! Yes! I'm so excited. It's my favorite Pokemon. Favorite Shiny. Look at it! So precious, so beautiful. When electricity builds up inside its body, it becomes feisty. It also glows in the dark. Want to learn Thunder Punch? Yes. Absolutely. Bye bye, Thunder Shock. I'm so happy. Let's see him now. Let's see him now. Ah! That is awesome. Ah! Let's look at his stats. Big boost. Look at that. Alright, so... Should we keep quick attack on him? Do I think quick attack's necessary? I don't know that I do. Let's go ahead and see. We're gonna teach him headbutt for sure. Uh, we'll get rid of Thunder Wave since we have a TM for Thunder Wave. If I need to teach him Thunder Wave for like catching legends or something, uh, then you know we've got that. So. I'm not worried about that at all. We can teach him Seismic Toss, but that's only going to do 25 damage. We can teach him Brick Break, which might be the better option, or Dig. Let's teach him Brick Break. <sighs> should we bother keeping Thunderbolt, or should we keep Quick Attack? Let's get rid of Thunderbolt, because we also have a TM for that, too. And then that way, if we need to go back and teach him either of those moves, we have both of them. Oh, yes. Mm. Yeah, I like that better. 
Alright, now let's go see what Jesse was up to. Look at him run! Oh my god, I love Raichu. Raichu will never not be my favorite Pokemon. Hey, do you see a kid run through here? Hey, did you see a kid run through here? Hey, did you see a kid run through here? Uh, what? Did she just give me a suit? Like, I haven't changed any outfit shits in this game yet, but I will change a suit. How do I... Here it is. No, I don't give a shit about fluff. It actually looks pretty good. I like that. Oh, okay, I don't like the shoes. We'll keep our we'll keep our regular shoes. I can't see the fucking bag. Is there was there a formal hat? Nah, I still like this hat better. Alright, we'll stick with that. Yeah, that looks better. Hey, have you seen a kid around here? Hey, have you seen a kid around here? The Pokemon Tower was erected in the memory of Pokemon. Okay, could we use a different word than erected, please? I am a channeler, one who speaks to spirits. I sense a lost spirit somewhere high in this tower. Is it Jesse? Do I have to be Jaden and save him? Oh shit, this is where we get uh, ha uh, Gasly's and Haunters too. Ooh. Should we replace Kadabra with a Haunter? I mean, Kadabra's got better stats, but. I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick. I feel like we're about to have to battle Jesse, and I hope it doesn't take too long. You there, if you wish to know the truth behind the wandering spirits haunting this tower. Well, even we channelers can identify them. But maybe, with the right tool. Yes, perhaps a silph scope might let one see the truth behind this mystery. Hey! If it is Merrick! Yeah, I saw you, uh, following some Cubone in here, and, well, after I got my Raichu, of course, I decided to come see what was up. But what are you doing here? I... <laughs> no way! Merrick, your Pokemon d didn't die or anything, right? No, 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 they're all fine. Oh boy, I'm glad I was wrong this time. When are you ever not wrong? Well, maybe I should check that your Pokemon really are doing well. With a battle, get your game on. Still only has three Pokemon. Starting with Pidgeotto. Ooh, you're about to go down to my new shiny boy. Look at him! Try out this new Thunder Punch. Quick attack? Man, you being a bitch. You being a real McAsshole right now. BAM! Almost killed it. Good thing we kept quick attack. <laughs> Are you serious? That motherfucker. There we go! That's it, I knew you could do it. So I noticed it says things for certain Pokemon. And it also, like, my Pidgeotto multiple times now has refused to die. I refused to get knocked out. I'm gonna see if I can let Raichu do this whole battle.
Yeah! Inazuma's fucking nimble! Like lightning! Okay, did you really have to do that? I don't think I have any more awakenings either. No, but I have full heals! Alright, that did a lot more damage than I wanted it to. Come on, buddy, get that flinch! It's alright, he's going down this time. Yeah! Are we doing this? Regular Raichu still looks amazing, but I love the deep orange of shiny Raichu. I like how their little animation, their little sprite animations are in sync too. Inazuma was thrilled to bits. Inazuma loves me. Eevee might be my partner, but uh, Raichu is my real partner. Look at that. Three levels below his Raichu and mine still outspeeds. Oh, don't cry, Inazuma. How dare you make him cry. You will pay for your transgressions! See, Inazuma didn't even want to flinch you. That's how fair he wanted this fight to be. He wanted to show you his overwhelming power. Maybe your Pokemon are doing a little too well. What are you feeding them things? Oh shoot! When we battled, we scared off that Cubone. You know Cubone, right, Merrick? It's a Pokemon that's always wearing a skull. That Cubone looked like it was searching for something. Maybe it's up on one of the higher floors. Uh, maybe, but we don't got time for that. So we, uh, we actually need to go and buy some items too. So while we're wrapping this episode up, we're going to run to the Pokemart. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Ejoicing, look at this, look at this beautiful Raichu running. Oh my god, I cannot get enough of this shit. Please, please, Game Freak, let every Pokemon game be like this from here on out. Maybe not with the Pokemon Go Catch mechanics, but oh my god. Uh, if you guys enjoyed seeing us get to evolve our favorite Pokemon and beat the crap out of Jesse in a rival battle, make sure you hit that like button down below for us. You know, we appreciate the support. We appreciate all of our subscribers as well. You guys have been fantastic with the support on all of our content, and we really do appreciate each and every one of you. Oh, whoop. Why you gotta go back in the ball? Don't do that. What's wrong, buddy? Always remember to save your game, because if you were to lose that data, it would be a shame. And we're gonna go ahead and get the freak out of here now, so we'll see you guys in the next episode.